All right. Now, if there's one thing that I hate in this piece of shit fucking game, it's fucking survivors. I cannot fucking stand survivor mains. People who play survivor, people who play uh, it casually, people who do it as a joke, people who fucking... Um, I, I just cannot fucking understand them. They are the most entitled, whiny, bad, garbage piece of shit players I have ever met in my experience of gaming. Which is really fucking saying something. Given that I have played fucking For Honor, Dark Souls, fucking Chivalry 2, Mordhau, fucking... I have played so many fucking ga Overwatch, oh, I can't forget that shit. Okay, the bottom line is, I have played so many fucking games with toxic fucking communities but this shit just takes it to a whole other fucking level i cannot fucking deal with survivor man i took a long fucking break from this game but i wanted to play again because i really like um the knight i fucking love taros kovacs i think he's amazing i think his power is weak it is weak, but a good idea, but weak. I mean, I would like to see a few buffs and adjustments to it. Like, maybe make the fucking Carnifex insta-down. Uh, maybe have the fucking... The, the, the assassin moves, like, twice the fucking speed that he does normally. And, um... I don't know, maybe perhaps, um... Have it where... Uh, the Jailer can like brand people and they're marked like you see their auras like for i don't know 180 seconds or something because some shit like that something new something innovative something fresh something to put these dumbass fucking survivor mains on their toes because i'm sick and tired of everything being fucking safe for these fucking idiots they have no idea how to play the fucking game they're all fucking trash all they do is bring meta perks um, abuse infinite pa god loops, because every fucking, uh, pallet loop in the game is fucking safe. Uh, bring busted perks, like fucking d d bullshit, like fucking, uh, what's the other one? It's prove like, I, I don't know, they, they, they're all bringing bullshit fucking perks, man. All of them. And if they're not bringing bullshit perks, they're doing toxic shit, like bringing sabo builds. It, 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 but no, but they never bring Sabo builds in is, is solo queue. They never bring Sabo builds in solo queue. It is always when they're fucking in a swoof. It's always when they're in their little swoofs that they bring these bullshit fucking perks and builds, man. So fucking stupid. And if I'm not playing a killer that can compete with that shit, what am I supposed to do? Like, no joke, I was in a match just now. Um, and I had a nasty, like, a mean 3-gen. Like, I was really stalling that match on. Like, really, I had a kill. I managed to secure me a 2k in that game. But still, bullshit, dude. Like, those other two should not have gotten away. Because they managed to finish the gen. Which is bullshit. It is, do you want to know why they finished the gen? Because the fucking detection aura of the guards is fucking useless. That literally, what is a fucking killer meant to do? And also, another thing, I get two matches in a row where it's fucking cat, fractured cow shed, and fucking cold wind farms twice in a fucking row. What am I supposed to fucking do against that shit? What is the killer meant to do? I swear to God, like, the, 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 there is like a personal vendetta that the devs have against killer mains. Because, like, the fucking forums are full of entitled, whiny, bitchy survivor mains crying about how, oh, killer's overpowered, how X killer perk is boring, how Y killer this. Like, the most recent thing that's come to their attention is uh, Sadako, which I think Sadako was actually underpowered before. And now she's got a rework where she, she can condemn. I don't really play Sadako, so I don't really know exactly what, um, what it entails. But she could basically condemn and more everyone a little bit like Pyramid Head, except a bit better. And of course, Survivor mains are bitching about this. It's the same thing with Old Spirit. Spirit was perfectly fine and balanced. Old Spirit, where survivors actually had to use their brains and try and predict where she's gonna like unfaze. But oh no, fuck that. We can't have any of that. We can't have Survivor mains using their brains. Fucking retards, dude. I'm so sick of this shit. All it fucking is, is catering to these baby fucking survivor mains with their little TTVs in their names, with fucking over 10k hours in the game, and they fucking suck. Like, actually get a fucking life, you morons. 
Like, they are all fucking bad. And to boot that, they fucking teabag and flashlight flick at the exit gates, because when, when they know they've won. Like, when they know they've won, because they're so fucking shit at the game. Like, they've got absolutely fucking nothing going on in life. It's ridiculous. And another thing. Um... The fucking gen defense. There is so... The, it, it, gen defense is so unreliable nowadays. It's so fucking unreliable. Like, what a killer's supposed to fucking do? No, seriously, what a killer's supposed to do? Like, us killers, we are human as well. Do we not deserve fucking fun? Do we not deserve to enjoy the game that we've spent money on? No? Why not? Seriously, why the fuck not? No, why is it only these bitch ass baby fucking mongoloid turd fucking shit eating dicks that deserve to have fun? Why? No, literally why? I don't under fucking I don't fucking understand. It's bullshit. As I was saying with gen defense, it's like dude, Call of Brian, nerfed, it's useless. Fucking um eruption, nerfed, it's useless. Ruin, nerfed, it's useless. Uh, Pop Goes the Weasel, nerfed, useless. Like, what the fuck am I supposed to do as a killer? The only reliable is, um, uh, what's it called? Uh, Deadlock. Uh, yeah, Dead Man Switch and, um, Pain Resonance, which those are the only sort of reliable gen defense that you have now. The rest of them are garbage. Jolt is, Jolt is garbage, dude. Jolt literally does fucking nothing. Oh, and it's fucking pointless, eh? I bring bloody party streamers. I bring bloody party streamers, and they still act like toxic fucks. You want to know what? I'm just going to bring fucking Morris every single game. How would you fucking like that, dumbass bitches? Oh, my fucking God. No, 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 I'm not going to bring Morris every game. Those are reserved for those cunts with TTV in their name. Now they, I have a fucking vendetta against. People with t t Survivor mains who stream this game and they exclusively play Survivor, fuck you. I will exclusively tunnel, camp, and mori you out of the game. I, it, it is now my mission. It is now my mission as a killer main and to any other killer main who may come across this video or watch it. Um, I highly, highly recommend that um, you come up with this tactic. Um... Don't play nice. Always make sure to secure a kill. Anything less than a 3k is unacceptable. That is a loss, in my opinion. Anything less than a 3k is a loss, in my opinion. Make sure to bring the most... The most... They're not busted, because there's no such thing as a busted killer perk. All killer perks are very balanced. But make sure to bring slightly stronger on than average killer perks. Um... Make sure to use the best add-ons for your killer, and make sure to get good with a killer. Yeah, you see, look at my fucking dumbass. When I bought the game, I was playing a lot of Ghostface and Myers. My fucking dumbass, because I like the movies. Fucking idiot I was. Literally a fucking idiot. I should have fucking played some shit like fucking, like, Nurse. Or fucking, or fucking, um, Spirit. Even though Spirit is actually f kind of fucking useless now. She's useless after her nerf. But it's still, like, such unbelievable bullshit that survivor mains just get away with the most toxic and abusable shit. And fucking killer mains can't do shit. And yes, I don't know if you may have noticed, like, the fucking I am locked out of matchmaking here, or I don't know. Maybe I'll put, like, some gameplay over this instead, because I don't think anyone wants to just watch, like, me screaming at the menu. Oh, no, screaming. Me just ranting at the menus. Um... But I am locked out of matchmaking because I deadass, I had to fucking rage. I had to fucking rage quit because I was chasing people um, on Coldwind Farms, the, the fucking really bullshit one with the fucking corn um, where you can't fucking see shit, the one with the killer shack in the middle of the map and it's fucking massive and you can't do shit. you got no fucking map pressure as night. Um, I had gotten one hook and they had done three fucking gens. Three fucking gens. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? So I get a down, pick him up. Oh, I'm gonna get my second hook. Oh, nice. It's a scourge hook. Guess what? Some fucking little wanker playing as Nia Carlson, the bitch, fucking sabos the hook. Bullshit. Fucking survivors should not be able to sabotage scourge hooks. That should be fucking illegal. That shit should not. That shit should not be fucking happening. That shit should not be fucking happening. That is bullshit. 
That is fucking bullshit, and the devs know it, and every and I think everyone watching this also knows it. So fucking stupid. Like, it's unbe fucking leaveable. Like it's unbe fucking leaveable. The um the shit that killer mains have to go through on the regular. I'm so. I'm not gonna quit, but oh my fucking god, it's tedious. Like change needs to happen. Change needs to happen. Gen speeds need to be way slower, way fucking slower. Um, they need to nerf a lot of the bullshit tactics that survivors do. Like, how about this? Um, put a cooldown on crouching. Like, they need to put a cooldown on crouching. Like, how about, so, if you crouch once, there's like a three second cooldown before you can do it again. That shit needs to happen, because I'm, I'm just getting so sick and tired of these cocky-ass bullshit survivor mains, dude. Oh my fucking god. Yeah, but anyway, that was like... That was like the little rant that I had to do. Uh, I, I apologize for the salt. I'm just so fucking done with this game and fucking survivor mains. But yeah, I'll, I'll catch you in the next one.